Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Monica, and in today's video, I'm going to be doing a spring clean and decorate with me. I will mostly be cleaning in today's video, but I will also add a little bit of decorating in here. I'm gonna be doing a deep clean in my kitchen and then just picking up and doing like a general cleaning throughout the downstairs of my house. So I hope you guys all enjoy today's video. Okay, so before I get started with the cleaning, I'm just going to quickly show you the rooms and what they look like right now. My family room is a little bit of a mess. Things are just not put away and straightened up. The kitchen is somewhat messy. It's not too terribly bad, but I'm going to be doing a deep clean in here and I'm going to be cleaning the cabinets and everything. So I just want to kind of give you like an overview of everything. Like in the living room, I have like some bags on the floor from shopping and then we did go out of town last weekend. So there's some bags on the floor and shoes everywhere. So I'm just going to straighten up and I will be doing a deeper clean in the kitchen, like I said, and then I'll be mopping and all that stuff at the end of this video. Okay, so I did sleep on the couch this night before my dog is having a really hard time going up and down the stairs and I felt so bad for him because he wanted to be next to me so badly and he took a little bit of a tumble when he was going down the stairs and I just felt horrible so I decided to stay downstairs with him and that's why I had those cushions on the floor by the couch. So I did sleep with him and just to let everybody know he is getting better. I don't know what it was. I think he missed some of his supplements that he normally takes. We were out of town and I just forgot to let my mom know and um, I think that's what the issue was. But he has gotten better and he's um, it's easier for him to go up and down the stairs right now. And he does have an appointment with the vet soon. And I will keep you guys all updated if you want to know that. If you are not following me over on Instagram, go ahead and follow me over there. I do a lot more of my like behind the scenes type of stuff over on my Instagram. And I do post a lot of pictures daily and just show a little bit more of my home and my life over there. So if you are not yet following me over on Instagram, go ahead and follow me over there. I will leave my handle down here. I will also leave it in my description box. Okay, so now that I have the dishes all done, I am going to start from the top and work my way down. And I'm gonna start by cleaning my upper cabinets first and then I will clean my lower cabinets. And for that, I will be using this new cleaner that I just recently purchased. And it is by Caldrea and it is the Pear Blossom Agave scent and it smells really good. The Rose Driftwood, I think it's called Driftwood Rose or something like that. That one is definitely my favorite, but this one smells really, really good as well. I want to be there and baby dance the night away. I let my head out if I want. Don't you just get tired chasing fame and being pretty all the time? Doesn't sound like if you are new to my channel and you are visiting for the very first time today, I just want to take a second and say thank you so much for stopping by. I truly appreciate every single one of you and I hope that you consider subscribing to my channel. If you haven't already, I do a ton of decorating over here as well as some cleaning and I also love to do some like DIYs as well. If I want Let yourself be free And maybe you will find That there is more to life Than being pretty Honey, let's just face it You can do better Let me show you what a good time looks 
Now I'm going to be cleaning the window right above my sink and for that I will be using the Method Glass Cleaner and this is in a mint scent. Now I'm just removing two little nightlights that I have up here on my backsplash. I do get asked about them all the time and I did buy mine at Marshalls, I wanna say maybe five or six years ago. I wish that I can find a link for you guys, but I can't. If you're listening or watching and you do have a link to where you can purchase these beautiful little chandelier looking nightlights, please leave that down in the comments below. I would love it if you would share with everybody because I do get asked all the time and I just cannot find them anywhere. I am also just cleaning with the same all-purpose cleaner that I used for my upper cabinets and I'm going to be using the same cleaner for my stovetop and my countertops and my lower cabinets as well. Okay, so now I'm gonna clean my stainless steel appliances and I'm gonna start with my refrigerator and I do lay a towel down on the floor as you can see right here because the overspray gets really slippery on the floor. And I don't know if you can really see on camera, but I have been using a stainless steel cleaner and it is by Wyman's. I will show you that here in just a second. And it looks beautiful for like two days and then as you can see, there is streaks everywhere. So. If you guys can recommend something to me and share with the viewers what you use to clean your stainless steel appliances, I would love it. Um, right now, this is what I've been using and normally I do love it. I don't know what is going on. I don't know if it's my diffuser that's causing this because I have heard of that before, um, but I don't know what it is. Like I said, it will stay looking beautiful for maybe two or three days and then streaks everywhere. So if you guys can recommend a really good stainless steel cleaner that you love, please leave that down in the comments below. Now I'm going to be giving my sink a really good clean and for that I will be using the soft scrub with bleach and I'm just going to be using the abrasive side of my sponge and I will be using gloves for this because this product does have bleach in it.
So once I have my sink clean, I am going to move on to clean my garbage disposal and I'm just dropping a plank down in there and it just helps deodorize and clean the garbage disposal. It has like a lemon scent and then I stuck a plank fizzies down in there as well and then it just kind of helps do the same thing. It fizzes up and helps deodorize and clean your garbage disposal. Okay, so now I'm just placing things back on my countertop and those are those little night lights that I was talking about earlier in the video. And over here, I wanted to style this area a little bit differently and I did take those canisters that were here on this wall and I placed those in my pantry. And then as you can see, I kind of struggled with how I wanted to decorate this space. So I did change my mind and move things around, but I am very happy with the way it turned out. And I wanted to add something a little spring like up here on top of my refrigerator. So I took that tray and then just added a planter with some white flowers in here with um, a little bit of greenery. And then I'm just gonna place everything back over here on my coffee bar, just the way that it was. My love is real and it's not just for the season Is what I feel, I don't need a better reason You broke your heart and come use mine My love will last, it'll stand the test of time My love is real and it's not just for the season Is what I feel, I don't need a better reason You broke your heart and come use mine My love will So I wanted to add a little something above my stove and I thought this mini wreath would look perfect. I found this at Target a couple weeks ago and I do have another one in my entryway and I just absolutely love it. I think it's really pretty and simple. And then that right there is my wine bottle opener and the cord was just bugging me way too much so I decided to just place it somewhere else more hidden. And that is it for my kitchen area. That is all the decorating that I'm going to be doing in this room and I think it looks so pretty. I can't wait to bring out the spring florals which will be in next video. So stay tuned for that. I'm going to be using some color and I am going with the peaches. I just think that peaches are so cute this year and there's so many different items in a, some of my favorite stores. So I did pick up a few things from Michaels and from Hobby Lobby, and I can't wait to decorate and show you guys what I do with those items. But I know I have to try, try to let her go, because she won't be mine. I listen when she talks, I watch her when she walks. She's giving me these feelings that I've never felt before, but she will never know. That I love her so well She's with somebody else And I will have to let her go Okay, so now I'm gonna move on into the family room and the formal dining room as well as the entryway. And I am just putting a few of the items that are on the floor in here that need to go upstairs. I'm just gonna place them on the landing. And of course I have to tell my beautiful Rocco how much I love and adore him and give him some good love. He is always following me around. He is always by my side. If you are a dog owner, then you totally understand where I'm coming from, but I just had to keep that clip in there. Okay, so now I'm going to straighten up the sofa, just kind of make the pillows look really pretty over here, and then I'm gonna get my diffuser started that's sitting here on this table, and the scent that I am using, it is called Good Mood, and it is by the brand of Woolsey's. Cause you'll never be mine, I watch her when she walks She's giving me these feelings that I've never felt before She will never know that I love her so well She's with somebody else and I will have to let her go She will never know, na na Never know, na na She will never know, na na
Now I'm going to be vacuuming the entire downstairs and I do get asked about the corded vacuum that I use down here and I love it so much. It is really good if you own any type of pets that shed. My dog sheds a ton and this vacuum picks up everything. I absolutely love it and it is called the Shark Duo Lift Away. I'm going to try to find a link and leave it in my description box if any of you are interested. You're the leaves in mid -August, and I've come out here to say To mop my floors today, I will be using the Thieves Cleaner and I am only using about three capfuls to some really, really hot water. And I will also be using my Oceder Mop and Bucket. I absolutely love this. If you guys don't have one, you need to get you one. I do have a link in my description box, but you can also purchase this at Home Depot, Lowe's. They even sell it at Target and Walmart. They sell this pretty much anywhere and trust me, you will absolutely love it. I am so happy that I took the extra time to really deep clean my kitchen. My house smells so amazing right now and it is so comforting to know that everything is put away and cleaned up for now. Trust me, my house does not stay clean like this all the time, but when it does, it is so relaxing to me. 
and I hope that today's video gave you some cleaning motivation as well as a little bit of that decorating inspiration as well. If you are new to my channel, please be sure to hit that subscribe button before you click out. If you did enjoy today's video, please be sure to leave me a thumbs up. Let me know in the comments down below what your favorite part of the video was and I will see you all in the next one. I hope you guys all have an amazing day. Bye.